Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Dokkan Battle video. And in today's video, we are going to be showcasing the new Tech Super Saiyan Future Trunks that is coming with the Int Future Gohan very soon on the JP side of the game. Now, before we jump into the gameplay and take a look at exactly what he can do, I'm going to quickly go over his details. So for anybody that already knows what he's all about, feel free to skip ahead to the gameplay. I'll put a timestamp. Uh, somewhere above my head over here and you can feel free to jump ahead if you'd like so without further ado guys let's take a look at this trunks starting with his uh, leader skill which is master student bond category which is a brand new category being added to the game uh, key plus three hp attack and defense plus 120 percent his super attack is heat dome attack greatly raises attack and defense for one turn and causes supreme damage and his passive is one of the longest in the game attack and defense plus 100 percent plus an additional key plus three and attack and defense plus 70 percent when there is an ally on the team whose name includes gohan bracket future plus an additional key plus six and performs a guaranteed critical hit when there is an android category enemy plus an additional attack plus 70 percent when facing an enemy whose name includes cell but excluding cell jr so uh, that was a mouthful, obviously, and that is a crazy long passive, but all you need to know is that at his full potential, he can do a crazy amount of damage. You're looking at 240% attack, 100% defense, and also plus 9 key, plus a guaranteed critical hit when the full passive is active. So obviously for today's showcase, we gotta get the full passive active. So uh, we are bringing this team right here, guys. Oh, by the way, his links are Royal Lineage, Super Saiyan, Golden Warrior, Cold Judgment, Messenger from the Future, Dismal Future, and Fierce Battle. All right, so those are all the details. This is the team we're bringing here, guys. And we are on the Int Cell Dokkan event, of course, because I want to have him do his max possible damage, right? So this is a Future Saga team. And unfortunately, we actually don't have the trunks on the first rotation, but we do have a really, really amazing second rotation, which is why I decided to keep this run. So we're just gonna watch these guys uh, do some damage first. We might actually take out this. Yeah, we might actually take out Cell here. Yeah, we're definitely gonna take out Cell here. So <laughs> we're gonna move on to the second phase of the fight. And uh, of course, some of you guys might be like, yo, but this guy is gonna be int. Uh, near the end, right? So it's not gonna be a bit of an issue with the tech trunks But obviously it's not going to be because we do have the guaranteed critical against Android's category enemies Okay, so we do have the physical future Gohan and also the new future trunks together Now one thing I do want to say is that his art is kind of weird. I'm not gonna lie like <laughs> I'm not loving the uh, future trunks is art. I think like it's something about his head or his his hair maybe or I don't know like the, the proportions seem kind of weird maybe that's just me maybe that's just me I think he looks kind of weird but that's okay because he's a great card and uh, let's see what he can do here with the Bula on rotation as well for support uh, let's go after Cell let's go after Cell so give him some orbs doesn't really matter he already gets the auto super and uh, I guess we'll attack this Cell Jr. here and let's see what Bula can do against this Cell Jr. I guess like I said it doesn't really matter and okay, first we're gonna tank a little bit. Nine damage. Okay, so we're taking nine damage, 99 damage, uh, basically double digit. And we are hitting, or our attack stat is at 2.3 million. A really nice super attack animation, by the way. Really nice animation. And uh, we did 2.7 million against Cell. There we go. First hit, 2.7 million, of course. Uh, we do have the full passive active, guys. We do have the future Gohan. We have. Um, we're facing an Android's category enemy, and we are also uh, getting the additional 70% for facing Cell. So obviously optimal conditions, but since it is a showcase, we wanted to have the optimal conditions. And uh, that was pretty crazy. That was pretty crazy, guys. <laughs> All right, so these guys are gonna take out the rest of the Cell Juniors here, I have no doubt. And let's see what he can do against the Int Cell now, uh, after. Okay, so let's just take out these guys. Here we go. Now. I did make a conscious decision in the showcase to not include the new uh, Int Future Gohan, and the reason for that is because um, that the new category, the Master Student Bond category, actually hasn't been added to the database yet, 
And for that reason, the Inn's future Gohan is going to be not at his full potential in a showcase scenario, right? So I decided to just hold off and wait until, um, you know, that gets added to the game before I actually do a showcase so that we can see him at his, like, max power. I know there's already some showcases out there, but, uh, you know, in the beginning of those videos, people had to say, like, oh, you know, you're not going to be seeing this guy at his best because there's no Master Student Bond category in the game. So... I'm holding off for now, and we're, gonna, we're just going to showcase this Trunks here. And uh, honestly, that's that's good enough for me. So I'm actually going to put Trunks at the beginning here. I want to see how well he can tank these attacks. Obviously, he does have type disadvantage, but his defense is not bad. Over 100,000. Over 100,000, so I know we're not going to die. Um, I still expect the Super to do over 100,000 damage to us. But let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. I mean, we're showcasing him, right? So... Let's put him in. Okay, we're doing. We're getting hit for ten damage. <laughs> we did. Not, we just got hit for ten damage for a normal. Okay, I like that. And two hundred seven or two hundred seven. Two point. Wait, two point zero. Wait, let's say two point one million. Let's say that was two point one million crit right there. And we're getting super for thirty seven thousand. Interesting. Interesting. Now, does he get? I don't think he gets like boosted defense or anything like that or uh, additional damage reduction on this event, I'm pretty sure. So that's just his tanking ability right there, guys. That's just, he's, he's just a very decent tank. Like, I don't expect him to be a optimal tank on like Super Battle Road or anything like that by any means, right? But um, he is definitely a serviceable tank. He's definitely a serviceable, serviceable tank. And I also forgot that actually he gets a uh, great increase, like a 50% increase to defense when he supers, right? So that actually probably explains why he only took that super for 37,000 damage, um, which is very respectable. Very, very respectable on one of the newer Dokkan events in the game uh, with type disadvantage. I'd take that, man. I would definitely, definitely take that. Okay, perfect. So we still have a chance here to attack with him one more time before um, we finish this event here. We did get through it pretty quickly, but the team is pretty OP after all. So uh, for comparison right there. Okay, so the Vegeta. The uh, Tech Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta just took that super for 13200. 100, 100, I'm getting confused right now. 132,000 damage, whereas the Trunks took a super for 37,000. I know it was the previous stage, but it's still a pretty big difference, right? Still a pretty massive difference. All right, here we go, my friends. Uh, let's actually make this last round a bit interesting. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pop the I'm gonna pop the Chi Lai here. And hopefully change some orb. Are you? What? Uh, oh wait. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Okay. I'm gonna try that again. We're gonna try that again. Okay, that's a little bit better. So we're gonna change some orbs here just for a little bit of fun. We already know what his max damage pretty much is uh, on this team, so you would have just seen the same thing again. So instead, we're gonna pop that item. We're gonna get an additional buff. Bu I almost said bust buff. <laughs> and let's see what happens here. Let's see what happens here. Okay, 3.1 million. Of course, this is not a proper representation of his damage, but it's pretty close. He only got an additional, what, like 700k on that attack? So, uh, yeah, he's pretty beastly. He's pretty beastly. Now, um, I do want to address the fact, of course, that we do have the best possible scenario for him. So let's say you don't have a cell enemy, right? Or you don't have a Androids category enemy, you're losing out on 70% attack and also 6 key and also a guaranteed critical, but you're still looking at 170% attack and defense, guys. 170% attack and defense, which is nothing to scoff at because um, having a future Gohan on your team is pretty easy to satisfy. Like All you have to do is just include the Gohan on the team that you're running. You don't even have to have them on the same rotation. You literally just have to have both a future Gohan and this guy on the same team and he'll get the 170% and also plus three key. And uh, yeah, that's still very, very respectable for a passive. You know, I would say that's that's great. That's, that's a really good passive still. So uh, yeah, man, this guy's great. This guy's really, really good. And of course, if you do have some uh, orb investment in him, he's still gonna have a chance to crit anyways, right? It's just not a guaranteed crit like facing an Android enemy. But uh, nonetheless, man, he's really good. I just feel like his art is kind of weird, but <laughs> that's besides the point, man. That's not important when it comes to how good of a unit he is. And uh, he definitely is a very, very good unit, guys. So that's going to do it for today's showcase. That is 
the new tech future trunks and um, I'm definitely interested to hear what your opinions are of course about this guy feel free to let me know in the comments down below and like I said once the category the new category gets added to the database I will definitely be doing a uh, showcase of the int future Gohan as well so stay tuned for that and that's it guys that's gonna do it for today's video hopefully you enjoyed it as always if you liked the video make sure to like the damn video and if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel and you like what you see then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the tiger squad now and while you're at it hit that notification bell too so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and that's it i'm out of here hope you guys have a fantastic fantastic day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media Signing out.